What's up guys, this is your boy Rusian, and we're back on episode 5 of the Hitchhiker's Guide to Raid Shadow Legends. Alright, so, where did we stop? By the way, just so you guys know, uh, during the time off camera, like I told you, uh, a couple of things were done. Checked, got a couple of uh, shorts, mystery shorts from here. Uh, did fight on the boss battles. Trying to get some equipment and everything. And I did fight in the arena. As of right now, I am on Silver 2. Kind of went to Silver 3, got pushed back again. Uh, basically, it's because of my defense. It's not that strong. But this is going to have to be remediated eventually. Because one of the problems with the Arbiter missions is for you to get it, you need to reach uh, you have to open up to level 10 of one of your affinity bonuses. Usually what I do is accuracy. So, still far away from that, but we're gonna work on that. Anywho, where did we stop? Missions! So, basically, rank 2, 5, star, uh, five champions. Rank 5 champions. Okay. Uh... Like I told you guys, I was going to work on leveling some of them. So right now, I have a total of three uh, four-star chickens. But I also have one actual chicken. So let's do this. Upgrade rank. Boom. By the way, if you guys don't know how I got that chicken, you need to go back some videos. I, I'm gonna leave the uh, the link below of uh, what the promo code I used. It's yearly gift, I believe. Anyway, I'll let you guys know for sure. Uh, so, alright, so I got Kyle uh, 5 star. So, this mission is complete. Next one. Win 25 lesser spirit potions from stage 5 or higher of the spirit keep. Oh, and by the way, just by running those missions without really trying that hard, I was able to get first place on the tournament. So you see, it's not that hard. Uh, I may have to collect, maybe not this one, but definitely collect a couple of energies. So, row of thumb. Oh, yeah, there we go. Row of thumb. Um, when you collect energies, don't try to collect the energy pots. Uh, they're more valuable the later you go in the game. Because the minimum, of, it will give you the maximum amount of energy for your level. So this will be raised almost every level you go up. So hold on to this as much as you can. Sure, this one for example, you have left for six days. If it's just a few hours to go, use that up. Same thing I do with my energy, my tokens for the arena. The moment the time starts running down, I'll just go to the arena and use all of them. Alright? So, quests, I can come in here, collect a couple of them. This is something you have to do every day, is run your daily uh, quest. Same thing goes for that pot when it starts going to uh, the reset. Come in here, collect this to make sure you got it. Uh, weekly, I still have those, I still have a few days. I have two more days. Well, actually, yeah, kind of two more days. And on the monthly, I can claim this one. So, those are going to be very quick for me to be able to get. Anywho, alright. So where are we at? So in daily logins, by the way, I'm on day four right now. I could have sprinted that, but I am trying to play for an amount of time that is feasible for most players. So you guys are able to know where you should be uh, by playing a couple of hours a day this game. I may later on, uh, in a few weeks, actually try to run as fast as I can into the Arbiter and see by day 7 where I can actually be. Anywho, let's go back, so let's go to the next mission, 25 Lesser Spirit. As a rule, always try to get as high as you can, as fast as you can. 
All right. All right, guys, so stage nine, that's pretty much how far I can go. Well, actually, I can't even go that far, but there is a way to change that. So Kyle right now is on level five. He is five stars, but what I'm going to do is... So, yes, you do need to be careful using your resources, right? But at times, you got to choose which resource you're going to use the most. Uh, if I don't upgrade him, I'll probably... Have issues getting uh, those potion shot. Uh, those potion pots faster, so I'm gonna be using more energy in this way. So my choice right here is come to Kyle and go away. Level him now. I will use all the pots, magic pots on him, magic brutes, sorry. Okay, masteries, I actually get his masteries now, that's another thing I forgot. Uh, you do have to keep this in check, basically because you don't want to be, you're going to be stronger if you raise those. All right. Now let's try again to go five. Whoa, wait, challenges? Yes. Give me some more. Alright, guys, so I ran out of energy, so. And I still have to complete. So my choice right now is I will be getting some of the Call of the Arbor series uh, energy, right? Because, like I said, these ones are set at 100. If I take the pots, I will get only 93 instead of later on 100 and something. So, share trailer, copy. That's all you have to do. So let me just get this as well. I can use gems at any time, so perfect. And now I'm gonna leave the rest just on hold. Let me just make sure I have six right now, so I need 19 more. All right, so finally done. Actually, this one was quicker than a lot of those other ones, so no complaints here. Now, I've cleared stage seven of Durin, already cleared. We in a total of five, four, five, or six stars artifacts from stage five of or higher of Dragon's Lair. Okay, let's see how far we can go. All right, another mission complete. Hopefully that's good. Well, not too bad. Uh, horrible subsets though. All right, so got a few gear. Win 50 bronze, silver, gold medals in classic arena. Let's go, 50. That's it. All right, guys, so I have about 30 minutes waiting for the arena to be able to refresh. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to get this chart right here. So place the crystal defense debuff on the Force Guardian while beating stage 5 of the Force Keep. Okay, so that's what we're going to do. Uh, I do have the crystal defense. That's usually what I'm going to hold you on some of those. Uh, let me see. So, one way you guys can find out if you have the champions you need is coming here, debuffs, and decrease defense. So, let's see who I have. Oh, brother, where a cow? Okay, decrease defense. Alright, both of them. Actually, he has, so I don't have to even to worry about it. So, level 5. Boom! The Chris D fans. Go back to one out of... <laughs> Alright, perfect. 
Next one. Oh, champions. Upgrade champions to level 40. There you go. So, stage 4 of Void Kip. 4 of Spider Dan. By the way, that's what I usually do when I have to wait for refreshes. I just go running some of those, as long as it's not the ones that just gonna suck up my energy. Um, I try to run those. I spent a couple, uh, not too bad, but it's worth because of the rewards. In this case, having a short is great. Uh, gonna help me in the long term. All right, mission complete. Now, this mission took a while, basically because I had, I would say, like, uh, to wait for four resets of the arena. So, but still, there are a total of 25 uh, fights won. It will take a while, unless you can fully clear, then it would reset by itself. Okay, next, upgrade the any artifact to level 16. And this time, we have enough silver for that. Alright, so, a little bit of change I may want to do. I may want to increase some speed in here. Alright, so we have some speed boots and some of a uh, speed helmet. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch this, equip, and get those boots. Should be this one. Equip as well. So that alone gonna increase like 16 speed, but now I'm gonna upgrade to level 16. All right, progress mission done. Now, just so you guys know, the reason why I have those boots because I farmed them while trying to get Harris, and while I was leveling uh, the food champions for Kyle. To get you into five star. All right, so clear stage three or higher of the Fire Knight castles five times on auto. We should be able to. And all right, to reach level thirty, we're gonna open the forge, which is great because we can make some of our own equipment. All right, so two down, three to go. Alright, so, uh, level 30 also opens Team Sita setup. Basically, uh, in a lot of ways, uh, for example, if I have multiple attacks, right, a uh, champion that attacks three times on A1, A2, or A3, I can actually put him, for example, on Fire Knight, uh, I need to bring his shield down, and I can use that attack to actually get his shield down, just by choosing what to use, right? So I would come in here, let me say, uh, this attack that attacks three times at random, I would decide not to use in round one and two, and start up on round three with Ninja. So I would have a chance to actually bring down the shield faster. Okay, so we're gonna go over that like later on, uh, not in this video, but I'll explain better how to use. Anyway, no interest right now, let's just try to beat him. Probably not gonna happen, uh, but I am high enough where I can complete the mission. All right, guys, so mission complete and we're able to get all the way to level six. Uh, I know some people may be arguing, hey, Russian, you should be able to clear even higher now. Well, yes and no, but if you guys are following, I've been saving as much silver as I can to be able to complete some of the other missions. So, I am not upgrading equipment unless I feel I really have to. So, I'm pretty much waiting for better equipment to then get to that point. So, okay, this is complete. Next one. Earn three stars on stage seven of Durham Forest on hard dif difficulty. So, this is my main team, but... 
there is a little trick. There is a little trick. Someone that actually helped me clear everything even up on Nightmare. That if I lose in this battle, uh, the three star, I can probably use her. And yeah, she's not great, but she's good doing one thing. Alright, too easy with Kyle being 5 stars. Okay. Complete. As you guys see, some of those missions I'm getting here. It just makes no sense for me to just jump in just right now. Win 25, lesser force potions. Alright. Alright guys, so another one done and just sucking all my resources. Alright. Uh, clear stage 7 of Felhuyen's Gate on hard. Done. Win 25 lesser void potions. Alright, so right now I need to come in here. Uh, I'm almost out of energy, so let's see which one would be best for us. So we already got those. So I can get with Bruce. Multi-battles. Brews, not brews, uh, potions. Brews. Yeah, so pretty much right now, um, I can pick any of them. I'll probably get from the beginning, just so I don't miss anything. Let's get this one. Void Keep and let's see how far we go. Alright, this one was down. Actually, Void luckily gave me a lot of energy. Uh, a lot of potions, but I still had to go back to the Call of Arbiter and get a hundred more. So this done now, earned three stars on stage seven of Felhuyen's Gate on hard. It should be fine. Now the big question is, so that's what I said, it's kind of like a trick. She's actually tanky enough to keep those guys alive, this guy alive. Uh, for the most part. I really don't feel if I have Kael. Well, let's try Kael, only because now he's 5 star, but a lot of times he cannot keep, they can't keep each other uh, alive since they're the same affinity and they're going against someone that is the opposite. And yes, yeah, like I said, Warpriest somehow comes for the rescue. So, two things going for her, she does have a shield set, but not only that, she's, like I said before, she's very tanky, and she's tanky enough to actually take a lot of the heat and still heal uh, the companion. Just so you guys know, War Priest at level 50 and El Hang at 60, that's how I cleared, uh, that's how I 3 star Nightmare campaign on my main account the first time. So. Just keep that in mind, I wouldn't 6 star her, but she can help a lot. <laughs> Alright, this one complete, clear stage 3 or higher of the spider den, 5 times on auto. Alright, I believe I had problems on 4? Ooh, 3. Alright, let's see guys. Alright guys, so this is complete. So those missions, like if you guys get around this point, you're gonna realize they just take longer because you're really dependent of uh, what you can get, right? So in here, upgrade two champs level 50. We did get some brews. Um, okay, only two of those, but we will need more energy. So let me come in here. Let me get this. And see if we luck out on Bruce, right? 
And no. Alright, so multiple choices I can do, right? I can abuse my luck. Come in here. Get this to the max. And then, for example, I probably not gonna get anything soon on this and just max it out. Still wouldn't be enough. Come in here. Max again. Boom. Get 50. Uh, probably not the best idea as of right now. So, what I'm gonna, gonna do. Um, I'll actually back out of here. I'll check how many multi battles I have. Four. Not enough. So, I will be coming. Get this multi battles that have four days left. Get one of them. Go to campaign. So, for the fusion uh, that I need for one of for the last mission of this state, right? I will need. I am missing actually. Let me go back. So, I am missing Diabolist from Brimstone Path and from Palace of Aravia I'm missing Hayrus, right? So I need to get those two. So what I'm gonna do is, I am on normal and I'm not... I would love to get gear but I need to really be careful with how much I'm spending on energy at this point. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna run 10 in 10. So let me get some food in just because she's already full. Let me get this. I can actually remove him. I'm actually gonna run him by himself. So I'm getting all the energy on Kyle right now. So let's run 14. Let it rip. Alright guys, so I got Hayris. And because of that, next step for me is going to be getting uh, Diabolus. So I already got her. That's fine. Great, 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 great. Let me come in here. Uh, I'm going to pretty much go stage 3 and just sell everything. I do have to level her, but... I gonna wait for a minute. So just coming filters and make sure it's not checked. So it's gonna sell everything. Yes. There you go. Let's go eight. Okay, so the reason why I moved up after I got Hayris, not just because I'm getting Diabolus, uh I'm actually where I I care about getting her, uh, but I care more about leveling him so I just moved up uh, that area of the campaign I get the most of the XP so just keep him there what I will do is probably remove the multi battle stop multi battle and then as soon as this battle is done what I gonna do is just let him run until he's done I really don't have to actually pay attention because the moment he hits uh, level 50, the game will get out of multi battle. So, and the way you do that, make sure uh, always that continue multi battle, even when all champions hit max level, since that's unchecked, start, and as soon as he hit 50, it's done. Or, when I run out of energy, what probably going to happen, may or may not happen before. So I just going to need to go in there and get some more. Stop the presses! <laughs> just realized I'm actually doing something wrong with my energy. And I'm going to show you guys why. So, I have not restarted uh, a lot of those levels. 
So the best thing for me, and yes, uh, if I stay just on this area of the campaign, I'll get the max, right? But I'll get a total of 14,000, but it's great. And I probably should do it, but at least what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to get three stars in all of them before I pretty much live on outer. So, the next time I come in here, this is already completely clear. I don't have to worry about uh, it's less energy I'm going to be using in the end game. Alright guys, so another one complete. Now, deal 1 million damage to the Demon Lord. What is not a problem at all. I made sure to save one key for that. So, right here, let's take a look. So, I am making 1.04 at normal. But, I could risk making less, but I'll do anyway. Let's see, let's throw someone in here. And I took a huge risk in here and didn't got it. So, 48 minutes, I need to wait to get another key. That's fine. Uh, not a big deal. So when you guys know you have those missions, it's always good to give a little chance. But at the same time, uh, if I had used on easy, yes, I would have completed this mission. Just ran breeze into it. But at the same time, I would lose on rewards later on. Okay? So that's pretty much it. Uh, so let's wait for that time to run in. Plus... It gets me a couple more... Well, energy is full, so what I'm gonna do is, since I have to wait 48 minutes, let's run into campaign. And let's run a couple more in here. Trying to get Diabolist. Alright, guys, so we're finally back on the Demon Lord. And this should be a breeze. I mean, we only need uh, 50k damage. What is already done. Oh my god. So now I get way over 1 million, right? <laughs> that, well, I need, but I don't need for the mission. All right, so mission done. Next one, ascend the champion to level five. And that's why I tell you guys, hold on. So right now, Kyle, yes, I can go all the way with him. Ascend, mission complete. Next one, earn three stars on every stage of all campaign locations in normal difficulty. Alright guys, so at this point of the video, I'm gonna stop and I'm gonna do this off camera. Alright, so we'll be back tomorrow for some more Hitchhiker's Guide to Raid Shadow Legends and trying to get that Arbiter. Anyway guys, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and as always, I'll see you in the game.